Welcome back all you coffee enthusiasts to another how-to video with us at DF64 Coffee Grinders. Today, we're going to run through a quick video on how to readjust the zero point for the DF64 Gen 2. So over here, as you can see, we have a DF64 Gen 2 fitted with a brand new SSP high uniformity bar. So, usually when you fit the DF64 grinders with a SSP burr, they are slightly thicker than the default set of burrs that you get, the stainless steel and DLCs that usually come with the DF64 grinders. So with that in mind, your zero point is bound to be uh, readjusted. And with that, I'll show you how to readjust the zero point for the DF64 Gen 2. So first thing first, after you fit the burrs, reassemble them back. Now remember, always look out for the manufacturer marking when you put back the top burr carrier. Manufacturer marking will indicate where the burr is supposed to sit and which notch is sitting at the top. Now once you do that, put the grinder collar back. Now you don't have to apply any force, just gently follow the grooves along the grinder. Okay, so tighten it until you can't tighten anymore. As you can see, the zero point is no longer at its default setting, which is directly on top of the exit chute. In fact, for me over here, it's facing this way. So, now we're gonna test for the zero point. So before we do that, before we turn on the grinder, turn the collar to a coarser setting. Always remember, never start your grinder at zero. You want to preserve your burr lifespan as long as possible. So always start at a coarser setting and then turn it finer. This also allows you to get rid of any grinds that were previously there in your previous grind session. Okay, once you've done that, turn on the grinder. And now, press the button. Okay, now slowly adjust it to a final setting as close as you can to zero. You want to hear the burst start to shim. Okay, there you go. At this point, stop the grinder, put the dialed ring on where the current zero is at and then fasten the ring onto the grinder now hand tighten it so that it doesn't move and you're done but before that loosen the collar a bit set it at a coarser setting so that when you turn the grinder back on again, it does not start at zero. So a final reminder once again, never start grinding at zero. This is to prevent damaging your burrs, ensuring that it has a longer lifespan. And that's pretty much it on how you readjust the zero point for the DF64 Gen 2. Let us know in the comment section below what you thought about this video and if you want to learn anything else. And until then, I'll see you again. Bye.